Hello and welcome to Leroy Plays Portal 2. I've decided that since I haven't uploaded a while on the Knife Chicken channel, uh, since my Knife Chicken Leroy YouTube channel got took down wrongfully, and it's still getting sorted out as we speak. So we'll see. Uh, if I don't know if I can get that back or not, uh, but I've decided to re uh, return back to Knife Chicken and start doing some videos on there. So I thought to start it off, I'll do uh, some Portal 2. I have played this a little bit uh, before. Like you see, I got up to the 4, but I can't remember anything. So, uh, we'll see how we do. And let's get right in. Good morning. You have been in suspension for 15 days. In compliance with state and federal regulations, all testing candidates in the Aperture Science Extended Relaxation Center must be revived periodically for a mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look up at the ceiling. Good. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look down at the floor. Good. This completes the gymnastic portion of your mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. There is a framed painting on the wall. Please go stand in front of it. This is art. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, stare at the art. It's a good mountain. You should now feel mentally reinvigorated. If you suspect staring at art has not provided the required intellectual sustenance, reflect briefly on this classical music. Please return to your bed. So I guess then this is the uh, tutorial part, like setting up the inverted and the controls. Good morning. Good morning. You have been in suspension for Hello? Anyone in there? Ha! <laughs> <laughs> dog, dog. You look um, good. Looking good, actually. Are you okay? Are, are you? Don't answer that. I'm absolutely sure you're fine. There's plenty of time for you to recover. Just take it. Please prepare for emergency evacuation. Stay calm. Stay, stay calm. Prepare. It's all the same. Prepare. It's all fine. All right. Don't move. I'm going to get us out of here. Oh, you might want to hang on to something. Word of advice. Up to you. I've got how to... Uh, how do I dock? You all right down there? Uh, how do I dock? I can't dock. I can't even jump. Most test subjects do experience some uh, cognitive deterioration after a few months in suspension. Now, you've been under for quite a lot longer, and it's not out of the question that you might have a very minor case of serious brain damage. But don't be alarmed, all right? Uh, although, if you, do, if you do feel alarmed, try to hold on to that feeling, because that is the proper reaction to being told that you've got brain damage. Do you understand what I'm saying at all? Does any of this make any sense? Just tell me. Just say yes. Okay, what you're doing there is jumping. Uh, you just you just jumped, but never mind. Say apple, apple. Okay, you know what? Let's case <laughs> All reactor core safeguards are now non-functional. Please prepare for reactor core meltdown. How do I? Okay, look, I wasn't going to mention this to you, but I'm in pretty hot oh, water God. here. How are you doing down there? You still holding on? The reserve power ran out, so of course the whole relaxation center stops waking up the bloody test subjects. Hold on, this is a bit tricky. And of course, nobody tells me anything. No, why should you tell me anything? Why should I be kept informed? You know, about the life functions of the 10,000 bloody test subjects I've been charged on. Why? It's close. Can you see? Am I going to make it through? Have I got enough space? Yep. Just, just gotta get through here. Okay, I just can't concentrate. And whose fault do you think it's gonna be when the management comes down here and finds 10,000 flipping vegetables? <laughs> oh, I hear that one. I hear that one. God damn. Okay, listen. We should get our story straight, all right? If anyone asks, and no one's gonna ask, don't worry. But if anyone asks, tell them as 
far as you know, the last time you checked, everyone looked pretty much alive. All right, not dead. Okay, almost there. On the other side of that wall is one of the old testing tracks. There's a piece of equipment in there that we're gonna need to get out of here. I, I think this is a docking station. Get ready. If I could duck now, I would. <laughs> Good news, that is not a docking station. So there's one mystery solved. Uh, I'm gonna attempt a manual override on this wall. Could get a bit technical. Hold on. Almost there. Remember, you're looking for a gun that makes holes. Not bullet holes. But don't worry, you'll Hot figure out. Seriously, do hold on this time. Uh. All right. Hello, and again, welcome to the Aperture Science Enrichment Center. We are currently experiencing technical difficulties due to circumstances of potentially apocalyptic significance beyond our control. However, thanks to emergency testing protocols, testing can continue. These pre-recorded messages will provide instructional and motivational support so that science can still be done, even in the event of environmental, social, economic, or structural collapse. The portal will open and emergency testing will begin in three, two, one. I can duck now. And there I am. Uh, I believe her name's Rochelle. I haven't played the original Portal, but you know, I I get the gist of it. Cube and button-based testing remains an important tool for science, even in a dire emergency. If cube and button-based testing caused this emergency, don't worry. The odds of this happening twice are very slim. Not okay. Go down. If you feel liquid running down your neck, relax, lie on your back, and apply immediate pressure to your temples. <laughs> you are simply experiencing a rare reaction in which the material emancipation grill may have emancipated the ear tubes inside your head. Sounds painful. Button. Mix photo. Ah, I've got to get the cube. Forget the cube and button to get the other thing. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Oh, nope. <laughs> and there we go. And then I don't know. Uh, that one. Yeah. First puzzle. <laughs> Good. Because of the technical difficulties we are currently experiencing, your test environment is unsupervised. Before re-entering a relaxation vault at the conclusion of testing, please take a moment to write down the results of your test. An Aperture Science Reintegration Associate will remind you for an interview. When society has been rebuilt. I'm just saying as well, I am not good with puzzles, so this game will either make me rage or after a while I will just don't I won't know what I'll be doing. So I'll probably give up. <laughs> Let's just say there'll be a lot of cuts in these videos. From where I've been spending like hours and hours actually trying to figure out what to do. If the Earth is currently governed by a manner of animal king, sentient cloud, or other governing body that either refuses to or is incapable of listening to us. Unlocking Tankover. Hey, hey! You made it! Hello! There oh. should be a, a portal device on that podium over there. I can't see it though. Oh! See the portal go. Have a look. Also, are you alive? If that's important, should have asked that first. And do you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna work on the assumption that you're still alive, and I'm just gonna wait for you up ahead. I'll wait, I'll wait one hour, then I'll come back, and assuming I can locate your dead body, I'll be <laughs> Alright? Brilliant. Go team! Go team go! See you in an hour. Bye. Hope you're not dead. Bye. Uh I've got to go up there, so... Jump! 
I did it. Wait, what, what did I do? Oh. <laughs> I did it! Yeah! <laughs> I'm going for the officers. So, what looked like officers. Some emergency testing may require prolonged interaction with lethal military androids. Rest assured that all lethal military androids have been taught to read and provided with one copy of the laws of robots. To share. <laughs> to share. Okay. Um. Um. Hmm. Ah. Uh, oh, I know. God, I'm stupid. <laughs> if you feel that a lethal military android has not respected your rights as detailed in the laws of robotics, please note it on your self-reporting form. A future Aperture Science Entitlement Associate will initiate the appropriate grievance filing paperwork. Is that a giant turret? Which oh is that supposed to be Glados? And then Glados is like the evil robot that took over the took over the facility laboratory whatever thing. Yeah, uh, they she took over that or yeah, I don't know. I know that, but I don't know about the animal takeover. I have to look uh, research that. This next test is very dangerous. To help you remain tranquil in the face of almost certain death, smooth jazz will be deployed in three, two, one. Not to guess that. Ah. That was pretty simple. Hmm. This one not so simple. Can I... Can I... Can I... Do... Yeah! <laughs> okay, so where do I want to put it? I want to put it here. And... So, oh, this is just... Uh, uh, there we go. Like the sixth sense. I managed to do it all by myself. Because this message is pre-recorded, any observations related to your performance are speculation on our part. Please disregard any undeserved compliments. I hope I don't do that. You know, like the, I've seen videos of people where they got really ill because of their long uh, loops. And I really don't want to do that. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to end it here. If the enrichment center is currently being bombarded with fireballs, meteorites, or other objects from space, please avoid unsheltered testing areas wherever a lack of shelter from space debris does not appear to be a deliberate part of the test. And with that, I'll end it here. If you liked, give it a thumbs up. Uh, if you want to see more, uh, at a more frequent uh, uploading link, if you want more of it consistently, uh, tell me in the comments. Uh, we also have a new uh, channel. It's an anime page. Uh, so we want suggestions from the viewers as well about different animes like top 5 uh, romance animes or top 5 overpowered uh, anime characters. Anything like that. Um, other than that, Thank you for watching, I have been Aftishin Leroy, peace out.